Hello friends, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. So I am getting lot of comments about the options which are available after third round. Right? Decision making you can do after third round and it will always depend on what decision you have taken in the round 2 phase 2. So it is very important that you take a correct decision in round 2 phase 2. Based on that some decisions will be available to you in round 3. So if you see the students who do accept and freeze, accept and freeze after round two, phase two, that means they are happy with the college. So those students anyway will not go into round three. They will not be able to participate in round three because they are doing accept and upgrade in the round two, phase two itself. So if you see that is a return, they are not applicable. And this is taken from the page 23 of 33 in the in comet key information brochure right so second are the type of students who want to do accept and upgrade after round two phase two so if you do accept and upgrade in the round two phase two and since round three is the last round of counseling you will have to do accept and freeze in the round three there is no other option you will be forced to take the college which you uh, got in the round three right and there is no cancellation available after round three for all the students who do reject and upgrade so okay if you are doing reject and upgrade after round two phase two again you will have to accept and freeze after the round three as there is no further round of counseling and there is no seat cancellation available fourth is this type of students who do reject and withdraw after the round two phase two if you are doing reject and withdraw after round two phase two that means you are not happy with the seat you want from exit from the counseling so for all those students there will be no decision available in the round three because they are not participating in round three now e point number e clearly note that all those students who have not got any seat in round one or round two phase two also that means these students are not having any and these students unlucky students will be able to do their choice filling editing in the round three only and if they get any seat in the round three the question is that will they be forced to take that seat the answer is no all those students who are getting the seat for the first time only in the round three they will have two choices they can accept the free accept and freeze the seat and pay the fees second option is they can reject and withdraw and exit the counseling because this is the last round so all those students who have not got any seat today uh, can do last two options but note that all these students who have not got any seat they will not be able to do choice filling for round two right phase two you will not be able to edit your options in round two phase two because you have not got any seat and now the last line we say is that there is no seat cancellation available after round three and if you don't join the college uh, you know you will be asked to pay the prescribed penalty additionally so that is the clause which is already mentioned that you have to take the college what you have gone so it is very important that you do seriously your choice entry right just don't do any choice entry and also don't do any choice filling only take the colleges you want to you know take in the round three don't take any rubbish college in any other city also so that's all update from my side. Thanks for watching and please do subscribe channel to get similar updates on the Comet K counseling related details.